Hello, everyone. RPG Kingdom Kenny are back with some, another episode of Kingdom Hearts Union Cross. Although it's more so of a drawing of a draw episode again. Uh, because, hey, through the whole month of October, they had a special drawing thing with the cookies. And I'm actually very excited to do this. Because, uh, yeah, we'll definitely get the... We'll definitely get that Sora medal. We'll definitely get a lot of those. Because, as you see, I have 2,320 medals. So, that means that's going to be... Let's see, it's 100 for every draw. So, yeah, it'll be 23 draws. Okay. So, it's not going to be that much. And then, of course, as you all know, I will sell the medals I will not use. So, we'll get two of those Sora medals. Well, we're guaranteed to get at least two of those Sora medals. So that's good. And then, of course, we'll sell all the medals, and then we'll do the draw points. Which, we have quite a bit of them. That'll be a 15, at least, for now. So, I'm excited for this. So, of course, you know, we have some strags. So, let's get those out of the way first. So, yeah, I'm excited for this. Um, Halloween, it's actually November 1st, as I'm recording this. And even though, like, the draw is for, like, one more day. Okay, so we can get these kinds of medals. That's actually kind of good, because I... I mentioned this like in the past, I was like, nah, there's some old medals I would love to get back, and I don't think there'll be a way for me to get them. Never get, but I guess there's a way for me to get them during this thing. So, uh, yeah, that's actually pretty nice, so. Alright, that's the two strikes that we have, now we have the 23 draws. Um, I'm actually, <laughs> I'll be honest, if everything go is going according to plan, I think this comes out on Friday. Yeah, I think this comes out on Friday, and they they did say there's going to be a, a, uh, an update of Dark Road, so that comes out on Friday and or Thursday, that'd be perfect, uh, and then that will be coming out after this. So I'm looking forward to that too, because hey, we'll actually get to see the new a new uh, character. Now I hope it's I hope it's this first week. They said early November was when the next episode of Dark Road will be coming out, and I don't know if we'll get an update sto uh, story updates uh, for Union Cross or not. Uh, it's been a while since we got that last update, right? I don't even really remember, but... Alright, here we go! Let's draw some medals. I did not hit the OK button. I thought I hit the OK button. Oh, I, I, I'm scared. I was like, hey, am I recording? And I am. Okay. I am recording. So I was like, I made sure I hit that record button. Okay. Oh! Uh, I think the only ones that really keep are the these three medals. The two Sephiroths on the bottom and the Axle metal. But, yeah. And we got traits. Yes, that's a good thing too, is that we'll get some trait medals. Now, I was actually contemplating, like, should I do this today, November 1st, or should I do it tomorrow on November 2nd? Because I ha tomorrow is the last day, that, or November 2nd was the last day you can do this. So I'm like, is there a way I would get more of those medals? Or more of the cookies? And granted, I think about it, I was like, well, it doesn't matter. I'd only get one, like, if anything, I'd get 10, so it wouldn't be that many. So I might as well just do it today. Okay, only two. I could use that stained glass one as a... Uh, I could use the stained glass one as a crate for my stained glass, glass one, but... Yeah, there wasn't, there wasn't really anything good on that. The Marlisha one is more than be sold. I'm going to keep Marlisha's. I have to like double check to see like which uh, metals I do and don't have so I can like level up. I know I've had Zigbar A. I think it's like majority of the organization B medals. Because back then, this was like years ago, they had the uh, like every 13th of the month they had like, hey, here's an organization event. If you got far enough, you got their B medal. I never got that far with all of them. And that was obviously before I got like the great medal for the now. So. Now, all these medals aren't that great, I'll be honest. Like, they're all, like, low-tiered medals, which, again, is not bad, considering, like, like I said, there's so many low-tier medals that I've missed out on. Oh, hey, we got a Sora! Sweet! It's actually kind of cool that we got this uh, Sora. So, we'll... I'll have to see how many draws uh, we can get, but, um... Yeah, I think we... I, the, the problem is, the ones I'm mostly missing are, like, a one or two stars. They're only giving me, uh, one, two, three, four, five. They're giving me nothing lesser than a five star, which doesn't really help me, so. 
today. We got the Halloween uh, uh, Supernova Plus Plus Halloween Star, so that's good. So, okay, we're still guaranteed to at least get one more of them, so that's good. So we'll get at, we'll, we're still guaranteed to get at least one more of them. If we'll get another one, I don't know. Probably not. Wow, that was like what the. That was like my fifth draw and I got it already, so that's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. All those will be sold. Most likely. Now, this might not be a long episode, because I. I guess I didn't think it through, I guess. But I, I, I like doing these for you guys. They're fun, and it's like. It's a nice little bonus thing, especially now that I'm like. Kind of in between LPs, you know, we wrapped up uh, the Pokemon Tundra, uh, Crown Tundra event uh, days ago, and then I showed the, um, I showed the, uh, oh my god, the Hyrule Warriors Age of Calamity demo, I showed that off, so I was like, that's cool, There's nothing really good there. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to get any of those medals that I was, like, kind of hoping for. I'm pretty sure I can just sell all those medals. Yeah, this is nice, like, I, uh, this is where this kind of video should be. It shouldn't be, like, oh, I'm, like, it shouldn't be taking a place of, oh, I don't have a, I'm not caught up, but I want to do this, and I want to release this as soon as possible, um, type thing. Not, not for this kind of one. When, when they're all these banners ones, these fit perfectly at the end of like, oh, I'm done with an LP, and I, I'm not quite ready to start the next LP. Well, this is perfect. I could just do something like this then. Okay. I'll probably put this in my actual trait. Same if that's the only one. I'll probably just end up selling all the metals that uh, I know for sure I probably won't use. Then I'll see if I can use it. None of these have been good. I mean, besides the Sora, no, which I... How far are we from getting the next one? Four draws? Okay. So we got the first one after... Let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see uh, so we got after five or four draws, I think. Is when we got that first one, so... And I remember, like, when that Terra Metal was good, when that Wing of the Blue Metal was good, and everyone was, like... Arms about that 0 0.2, uh, 0 0.2 Sora metal. God damn. Alright. Uh, I definitely will, am gonna have to end up selling some metals. I think I'll sell metals now. After this. This is why I have room. Okay. The list. Okay, I know for sure I'm selling you, you, you. You know, I should just end up selling all these because there's six stars. I already have or five. If they're five stars, I have already had their six star. So.
yeah, that's why I was like, oh yeah, let me do trade. And then, hey, you know what? Uh, we'll have 23, we'll get 23 trait medals. So each of my swords can get 10, and then I can decide, uh, The majority of these are blue. There's one that isn't. The one that wasn't. So, so the election's over, guys. <laughs> At least by the time you guys watch this video. Thank God. I just like. Granted, I know things are probably not going to be better no matter who wins. But um, I, I can hope that maybe, maybe we can have. There's like a small sliver of hope. Of, like yeah. Shit won't be as bad as it was, so hopefully things can start being okay soon. Okay, so I need to set the off. Okay, I saw you so No, I'll probably never use you as a metal unless you know you need it as a crab mode. I, I need to start doing those again. At least trying to like catch up to it. I don't need to like have them completed, even though I would love to have them completed. Uh, so the Sephiroth, Ursula, and the Stained Glass. Yeah, majority, like those trait metals that I have, I would love to get rid of those to use as. Okay, never mind, I don't need the Ursula then. You have pretty good trace, but let's see if we can get you a better one. Let's see if we can get you like the attack, uh, extra attack at 50% or uh, ground at 70%. Or something like that. Then we have power. Let's take care of those. I know for sure I could probably use the stained glass one for uh, traits. Okay, you can't level you up. I'm not worried about this one going on over an hour like I did with the draw tickets. Actually, as a matter of fact, I think, uh, I think, uh, starting on Monday, they're gonna do something special with the, uh, um, they're actually gonna do something special for the trait medals. Or not trait medals, they're gonna do something special with, um, they're gonna make, like, another draw event. Or, uh, like another like draw ticket event, so that's gonna be fun. Okay. Okay. Uh, shop. I was like, what am I looking for? Shop. Okay. okay. So I am for sure gonna get another Sora, but will I get a third Sora? Oh, that's gonna suck if I get a third Sora. Then I have to get them each. I won't have enough traits. Speaking of traits, I can put you into the. Oh wow, you are the. Okay, I guess that. I... Huh. Weird. I, I didn't notice that that was a musical one. I didn't see the notes or anything on it. Uh, okay, let's get that Sora. It'll be hilarious if I got two Soras in this. I highly doubt that would be the case, but can you imagine? Yep, got another Sora. 
gonna be great if I got one boosted. But yeah, no, I actually, I actually love this how. I think I don't remember if it's for every Monday or if it's just every Monday leading to the event of the release of Mem Me Melody of Memories because they're having a little event for that. Where it's like, yeah, every Monday you'll get a, you'll get three thousand jewels and up to the release. But I don't know if it's for every Monday this month. They did that for October, so that's awesome. Oh, That's all water. Actually, maybe I'll keep that Pete, because I don't know if I... Because I, I think I accidentally sold a Pete. So I'm going to see if it was that Pete. Although I don't think it matters anymore, because I think I've already had it like at 120 or something like that. Like, I had it not a big deal, but you never know. Oh, how many, how many do I have left? Five? Okay, perfect. So chance we could get another Halloween Sora. I'm actually like curious how many cookies you guys have gotten for this. Like how many cookies did you guys get through the whole event? Uh, I know there was like a, I hate that they tied like how many cookies you got depending on like your ranks for uh, high score events. I feel like people should get the chance to get the same amount of cookies as everyone else. So I feel like you know they had the whole. Uh, now, granted, that, that means they'd have to get rid of the. They had the. They had some cookies hidden behind a. Oh, you know, like every single week they like, hey, buy the extravaganza weekly thing, and you unlock all these quests. You know, you unlock quests that get you 14,000 gems or 1,400 gems. You unlock quests that give you 100 cookies. Uh, I, I kind of. They'd have to get rid of that. Uh, they would have to only make it so like here's some quests. Here's some like extra quests that you can do. You know, that's not part of the story or, or such. Like here's quests you gotta do during the raid that uh raid bosses and Union Cross. I feel like those would have been the best times to have those would be the only times to get cookies. So I, I really wish that they like have it so everyone should get the same amount of cookies. Instead of like, nah. Like, yeah, you can all get the same amount of cookies to the extent, but then majority of you will only be getting like uh half. Like Oh, only, like, the per person on first place for the, uh, high score, uh, challenge would get 200 cookies or something like that. Like, I really hate that. I really hate that. And that was the last draw. I mean, obviously, the reason why, like, the dailies, like, the dailies here is, like, uh, yeah, defeat, uh, defeat three raid bosses and you got 10 cookies. Something like that, and I think, uh, I don't, I don't think they were unlimited, were they? Oh yeah, there was, but that was like a complete, you know, complete 20 Union Cross quest, which I believe was like for that week, for a week, maybe? It wasn't a daily thing. Or maybe it was for the month. I honestly don't remember, because the limit is usually for months. Except like, you know, I don't know if they'll change it back, because they got rid of, they seem to have gotten rid of the, of the uh, you know, do like 30 PvP matches for uh, every PvP week. I don't know if they'll bring those back. I I kind of wish I kind of hope they don't. But yeah, so I was like, okay, so you got like that. That would be fine, you know. I I would be totally okay with that. So medalist, basically sell everything. I don't think I'm gonna keep any of these. Yeah, no, I don't need I don't need to keep the stained glass one. Draws right there. So a seven reverse ten. Uh, reverse. Okay, I do. I do have it. Okay, so I can sell that. Uh, 
seven. Well, actually, we're going to seven. I think it's just good now. Yep, there it is. Use your portrait. Uh, I believe that Kyrie was like, this Kyrie was like one of the most popular metals that like a lot of people in Japan like. So they're like, oh yeah, we'll make it into a supernova plus plus then. That's pretty cool. Alright, let's put uh, some 10 trait medals into you. See what traits I, what traits we can get unless I unless I like the traits I get within like the first six. Alright, not bad. Kinda wish it was a 15, but that's not bad. If I can get one that's a 15 extra power, that'd be fine. Maybe a, a raid bonus. Maybe I could implement you into my uh, my uh, power raid keyblade. So that'd be cool. I mean, not bad, not bad so far. I mean, the poison fucking sucks, but still. So that means for sure you're getting seven. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of the resist ones. Like, I get why they're there. Like, I, I totally understand why they are a part of the thing. I totally get it. But at the same time, it's like, not... It's more so for, like, the raids are, and even, like, PvP than anything. It's not, like, that great for... Also, I don't know how to count. Okay, well, I can get rid of the poison. Now, this isn't a bad setup, in all honesty. However, I do have four left. If I'm able to get two of them as 15,000 attacks, I think I'd be okay with the setup for this one. Okay. Not bad. Again, I, I think I'm okay with some with one like that, but, but if, again, if I can get two 15 attack, 15 plus attacks, I think I like it a little bit better. Alright then, stop. Okay, well, yeah, two more tries. Alright, yeah, two more. Oh shit, there's, I, I saw, the, I saw two males I can still sell, that's fine. So if you guys can hear that, which you probably can, is I shaved last night, so I'm just like rubbing my, you know, stubbles that are there, that I like do overnight, so yeah. Okay, last one. I need to like, I need to get like an after shave lotion or something like that. Alrighty, not, again, I am okay with this setup. Now, if I get a better setup with this one, uh, then the last three medals will probably go to him. If not, they'll each get one more medal. Or actually, it all depends on what's all on him. It all depends what this one gets. Because if he gets some shit ones, he'll probably get them all. So. Alright, right off the bat, he, he already has a better uh, one than the other one. Not bad. He already has 1,500 more. 500 more. Alrighty, that's not bad. Now, if you can get a ground one and an extra attack power, I always forget about extra attack power. If you can get an extra attack power and a ground one, I think you'll be okay. Alright, there we go. You got the two 15s. It took those threes, so let's see what you get for everything else that you have. Again, an extra attack and a ground, and I think you'd be go a good setup. All right, there we go. We got the ground, at, and it's at 70%. The aerial one is at 60%. Not bad. However, if this one becomes a 70, that's great. Then I need an extra attack power at 50. 
Alrighty, that's not bad either, but he still has five more to get, so... There's a chance that I can get an aerial at 70 and an extra attack. If not, I think I'll be okay with an aerial at 70 only, because then I think this will be fine. Because, hey, I have the bonus traits that they can get uh, during the training, so I could put, probably, probably put them both in there and like maybe one of them could get the extra attack power at 120, which would be great. Yeah, there we go. Aerial 70. Okay, that's good. That is good. I'm still going to honor the, you know, the last uh, three left that he had. Uh, two left. Or three left. Yeah, he has, he has two left now. So if one of these becomes an extra attack power, that's not bad. If not, uh... He has one more now. After this one. I'm, I'm debating, like, do I do a, do I give all three to the other metal, or do I give, you know what? That's a tough one. That's a tough one. No, 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 no. Uh, no. So, here's the, here's my, you know what? He'll get one more, and the other one will get the other two. I think that's a fair. I think that's fair. Okay. So he gets one more, right? Or was that the last one? Yep. Nope. He gets one more. And now... Oops. And now the other one. The other two go to the other one. Uh, now here's hoping that one of them is a 1500 and the other one is a uh, special attack. Or they're both 1500s. I can live with both being 1500s. Alright, not a good start. <laughs> then I'm kind of hoping for the extra attack power. I'll probably get rid of one of the attacks then. No no enemies, no enemies, no enemies, no stop! Alrighty, they were both defense. Not bad! I mean, th this is a good setup, okay. Like, this isn't a bad setup. I would just honestly like it if it was two 1500s instead of two 1000s. And maybe an extra attack power instead of maybe the defense. I don't know. But this one for sure is not a bad one either. Like this is this is an extra 4,500 attack or an extra 4,500 strength. And he's great. At like uh, 70, he's 70%. He'll deal 70% more damage to aerial and defensive enemies. So they're not bad. What is your uh, special attack? Here? He has eight hits. Resets count. Okay. That is actually a pretty good one. And that actually might have been helpful during the, uh... During an event that's no longer available now. But, uh, maybe not, actually, because he reverses, uh... Or he reflects the attack power of, uh, upright metals. So, well, not the attack power, but he reversed up anything by upright. The wrong thing. Okay. That took a good 30 minutes. Now, how many draws do we have? 24. Awesome. That's like that's like how many draws we just did. But the good news for this one, it's only going to be 24 medals, and don't have to worry about much. All right. I know for sure I already have a boosted one of you, so you are probably going to be a uh, trait fodder for that one. If I do not already have traits for that one, which I probably did, probably don't. Another uh, reversible. Okay, I think I have a boosted one of you. We'll see. Okay, not bad. Those two aren't bad. They're not bad draws. I think I have a boosted one of you. I'll have to see. I know I got a lot of you during the fucking... The last time I did this, so... You 
are for Boots, by the way. I think the Boots and Hades I have is already good. Um, how many of those uh, key arts did I get again? I think I got seven of them, right? I think that's how many of them I got. I still need to put... I still need to put traits in, like, uh, five of them, because I think I put traits in two of them. And I still have so many Storlesia trait medals, but I'm I'm good with the... I'm good with the traits that all my Storlesias have. If I actually... Sh uh... I, I, uh... <laughs> I actually made the perfect... And I lucked the fuck out, too, with this. I made the perfect Storlesia... Uh, metal. That's perfect for raid battles. Uh, so, four of her traits are raid battles at na and raid battles 50%. That's not good. That's not bad. And then her last trait is extra attack power at 50%. That's pretty good. And then her special trait metal is uh, raid damage at 100%. I looked out. I got that, like, either the first time or the second time I, 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 uh, put her in that medal. Just have her do that special training. So I lucked out with that. I lucked the hell out with that. And I was like, god damn, yeah. I, 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 so she is dealing an extra 300% damage to raid bosses. Which is crazy good. And I gave her a Lux boost, an attack boost type thing, so. But you got poison, so you can't do that. I think I'm done for it. So, like, she is. Oh, she is great. Now, am I. I was honestly thinking, like, well, would I rather have her be at extra attack power at 120% or with the. what she currently is? And I think she's a lot better where she currently is. Because then it's a 250% damage that she's doing to raid boss, which again, isn't that bad, especially if she has an extra attack power of 120. But I think I think the way I have her set up is, you know, doing extra 300% damage to raid bosses and at 50% uh, extra attack power. I think that's a good setup for her. I honestly do. I honestly do. And then I have another Sterlitzia that I think is, like, perfect for regular quests. You know, she has negative 70 for both aerial and ground. I think she has another one that's at 50% uh, attack power, extra attack power. And I think her other two are 15,000 uh, or 1,500 attacks. Or 1,500 more strength. So, so that's a good metal too. It's technically my most powerful metal of the Storlexia is because of that, obviously. But in all honesty, I'm going to say the Storlexia that has the, uh, the, that's perfect for rage is the perfect one of those two. I think, I think I was going to set up one of the Soras like that, at least I could. Because I have so many trait medals. Actually, no, I don't have that many trait medals, I forgot. I think I got one per... Uh, 10 draw I did, so I probably don't have as many trait medals as I get from Storetia. I know for Storetia, I still have, uh, not, at least one thing of 99. So there's that. So after I do all these draws, I'm gonna sell all the ones I know for sure. I'm like, okay, I'm not gonna... I, I was like, I don't need you, I don't need you, I need you, I don't need you. So I know for sure I'm gonna sell those. And then we'll see how many draws we can do afterwards. Probably gonna be like either one or two. Actually, probably be at least three. I'm gonna say at least three. I think I already have a boost in one of you. I'll have to see. I'll have to see. So we got four more draws. And I mentioned this before, I mentioned this during the ticket draw event. Is if I didn't have these videos, I don't think this series would be as long as it is. <laughs> If I only focus on story, on the story bits, and uh, nothing else, this story, this, pro it would still be in the 100s, no doubt about it, but I think it'd be like in the 120s, maybe, or close to it. So, I know, honestly, I, I kind of should do that as like, okay, which one of you? Luckily, I kind of named them as like, you know, stuff like that, so I 
back and be like, okay, this thing counts, this doesn't count, this doesn't count. No, speaking of not counting. The last one. Something good? I think I actually have a boost one of you, but you're... You kind of suck because that's the Psyax that, that it costs all... No, no. It's the Psyax that costs all of my uh, SP, so... Uh, okay, so I already have a Sephiroth. Bad one. It's not a bad one to get off the bat. Uh, I think for sure I'm going to sell those other two Sephiroths and the Xehanorts and the Rikus. Um, but let's just see. And uh, I, I am going to sell the Sora. The other Sephiroth, that Sephiroth, that Sephiroth, that I already had, but I don't think it's a Sephiroth I'm going to use, so. Let me look at this thing. Marluxia, for sure, is getting sold. Those two Rikus are getting sold. The, the Dark Riku, oh, the, this Riku. The Riku, the Dark Riku. Let's see about you. I'm just not a big fan of the HP, the more HP. It's not a bad one, don't get me wrong, but uh, I, let's see if we can get like an extra attack power or uh, more strength. Or if that was a 70, I probably would have replaced the 60 one, so. And I'm, and I'm okay with you. I'm okay with you. You're not terrible, but you're not that great either. Uh, the Ventus, the Ventus. Yeah, you're not terrible, but you're not great either. Um, yeah, you're okay. Uh, I guess you can check the Sora. I might be able to, like, use you as a strength, but I thought I think I already have you. No. If I did it for the reason I'm doing for this one. Sure, we'll see. We'll poison over right defense boost one. Honestly, I don't care. Defense boost. If it's not a max, it's totally fucking worthless. Just like that. Okay, so those can all be sold. Xehanort, and maybe the Aqua. Actually, I think I'm not going to do something with the 
Yep, okay. You got a point. You got something shitty like that? Yeah, no, I'm get I got you. What the That's something I need to see. It's probably a defense move you want, because we all know none of them are ever And I much like that more than poison resist. Yeah, it's the best boost one. Not a big deal. Uh, Zaya. Not bad. Ah, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. You know what? I'm gonna do it anyway because you have two aerials, so maybe this would be a brown. And that would be able for me to sell everything, and then I could do like that's gonna for sure be at least four draws now. Actually, no. Uh, probably two. Okay, that was only worth one drop, but we have a total of two, so. Which I'm okay with. Maybe we'll get one of those, uh, one of the boosted Illustrated Kingdom Hearts 3 characters. Actually, are they Illustrated or were they something else? Fuck yeah. Fuck yes. Yes, I have two of them now. I have two Ventuses. It sucks that I do not have any traits for him, but I'm good, I'm happy for him. I now have a regular and a boosted of both of those for the Terra, Aqua, and Ventus. So I have one that's a regular and one that's a boost. That's awesome. And you can be sold. So that was good. That was a good one. I like that, I like that a lot. So yes, I now have a boosted Ventus, but I have no traits, so that kind of sucks. But anyway, guys, that is going to do it for this part of Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Union Cross. Um, there will probably be a story update sometime this month. Don't know when. I hope it's before Melody of Memory comes out, because I, I am going to cover that game. And of course, there is if there when there is a special uh, drawing event, I will do that again once it's all done. Hopefully, it won't be a big one like it was for the last month of September. So we'll see. We shall see. I really like these events. I like doing these um, events. They're fun. They're fun. And uh, I hope you guys enjoy this. So thank you all for watching this video. Guys, if you liked the video, please give that like button a click. Comment down below if you guys like about the video, didn't like about the video. Let me know what you guys, uh, in your guys' is, uh, if you guys have played this game, how many uh, pumpkin swords did you guys get? Obviously, we had enough for two, and uh, we got two, so that's good. And I'm actually happy with the two traits that they both have, so yeah. And as always, guys, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss a beat. And subscribe to my main channel, too. That's in the description below. So also follow me on Twitter. Both my main Twitter, the RPG Keep Kid Twitter, are in there, too. Thank you all so much for watching once again, and I'll see you all next time.